Ready? One, two, three, four. We, we exist. exist. Yay! Hello, everyone. Um, this is the Art and Proud African LGBTI YouTube channel. I'm Larry. I'm hanging out with my friends this afternoon. The weather is nice and lovely. Kensington Park is where you need to be. You're missing if you're home. Today, we'll be talking about uh, the Pride Month, month of June. And we'll be talking about our popular slogan in Art and Proud LGBTI, We Exist. I am Larry from Nigeria. The month of June, the Pride Month, is a celebration of love um, for the LGBT community in gay, lesbian, trans, intersex, everyone. We are all acceptable. We rejoice in this month of June. And in Nigeria, uh, same-sex relationship is punishable uh, by the law. It's minimum 14 years imprisonment. Uh, the cultural beliefs of the country is equally against same-sex same relationship. But here we are in a safe country. We exist. Gay, lesbian, whoever you are, you have right to live your life. You have a right to love. Love is not a crime. I will hand you over to Nadim. What do you Thank have to you, say? Mary. Yeah. For me, like, my name is Nadim. I'm a gay man, a proud gay man from Bangladesh. And for me, pride means a big, big, it's a big topic, you know. Pride, it means a lot. But for me, pride means, you know, acceptance, accepting yourself and being able to you know, stop. You know, there is a lot of hate crime going LGBT people. Yes, we can celebrate pride, this and this. <coughs> we can wear the rainbow outfit, but at the end of the day, we have to stop the hate crime going around. So that's what pride means, celebrating the freedom for everyone. You know, we've been lucky to be able to celebrate ourselves in the UK, but there's a lot of people in the other country are not that lucky to be able to celebrate they're still, you know, hiding themselves. So be able to express for the people who are not able to, you know, come out. So able to show them, you know, how it feels to be out and proud, you know, able to live your gay life, you know, openly and proudly without a fear, without a, you know, your life threat. Mm -hmm. And in my country as well, like as your country as well, in my country, being gay is criminalized as well. It's a 10 year imprisonment and also, in my country, is a Muslim majority country, so where, you know, there's a lot of pressure from religion that, you know, you cannot be homosexual, being homosexual is punished, and after you die, you know, there's a lot of big myth. You know, wow. I don't want to go in detail, we can sit down another day, we can go no in problem. detail. And also society, you know, they don't accept it. So being gay, you know, after age 30, you know, if you're not married, society start questioning, you know, why are you not married? And being with another, you know, same-sex partner, is not really accepted so for me you know love is love you know love has no gender no no meaning you know you could love anyone you know right. it doesn't have to be opposite sex so for me doesn't matter which country we live which country we you know stay we should able to express our love without fear without you know any problem you know love has no limit you know you can love anyone so that's much. what my meaning to you know, and we should take action to stop all the problems happening around the world. Thank you very much, yeah. Nadim. Uh, Julius, from Cameroon. Yes. The Pride Month, what does it mean to you? Thank you very much, the kitchen. The kitchen. My country, the Middle East, you can practice there. All right. Because if you can catch you there, you then put this straight away to jail, five years. So I'm very happy to be to England to practice my sexuality. So I'm very, um, my country can do nothing. Okay. Yeah. So you are proud to be celebrating the month? Of course, yeah. And yeah. we exist. We exist. What does it mean? Yeah, we okay. exist. We exist. You can live your life the way you are. Being a Cameroonian, being a Christian, you exist. We exist, yeah. Being a gay man. Being a gay man, I'm a gay man, yeah. We love you. We love you. Thank you. Me too, love you. Ah. you Dio from Uganda, can you introduce yourself, please? Thank you. Uh, I'm Dio Ontari, a proud gay man from Uganda, Kampala, currently lives in North London. Um, 
heard means to me celebration of uh, the rights of uh, gay, gay communities and uh, to be proud of what you are and to believe, to believe in yourself yeah. of what you, 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 or what you believe in as a gay person. So we have a life to live and we, are, we, we have to believe what you are. So I'm proud to be what I believe in. And we exist. And uh, we, we have to <coughs> exist. We have to live, we have to live uh, our life. Good. Thank you very much, Dio. I want to introduce yourself, please. Oh, thank you very much. My name is Hamza Matovu, a gay from Uganda. Uh, in Uganda, where I'm coming from, being a gay or resilient or transgender, it is criminal or oh, whether you can be arrested for life. Oh, not only that, the community, even religious, I am a Muslim, but religious, they are against it, but we have to exist. Love is love, but in my country where I'm coming from, it's really terrible. Life, you can be very hard, but uh, ever since I came into this country, I really feel so safe, there's no problem, and I'm proud to be gay, there's no problem, and I can't wait for this celebration of the pride, whereby I I do intellect with different people from different backgrounds. Yeah. But uh, back home, it's really not good. And even just recently, the government, they were doing uh, they were an election. The president was against it. He was so... The, the speak was all against gay, lesbians, and transgender. But here, here I am. I'm safe, I enjoy, I can interact with all different people. I right. have no problem. I can I I do <clears throat> exist. I believe in what I am. I have no problem. I'm safe in this country. Pride means a lot to me. Pride means a celebration. I can I exist and uh, means whereby I can practice what I believe in. Of which back home in Uganda you cannot because it is criminalized. If you are caught, you can be imprisoned. And even the community, I'm from a Muslim background, whereby it is against it. I can't practice my, my belief and love. Like this month is a pride month, whereby we month of love, yeah. Okay. Yes. And we exist. And we exist. The slogan of uh, Art and Proud African LGBTI. We exist, but back home, it's hard, it's difficult. It's all right. Yeah. Thank you very much, Hamza. Thank you, brother. Right. I'm happy for you, Hamza. Thank you very much, brother. We'll talk to uh, Peter from Kenya. What does Pride Month mean to you? Pride Month means love. Back in my country, we don't exist. Uh, as a gay man, we have no, we have no freedom. We can be out and proud. We exist. That slogan of Art and Proud African LGBTI, you put it on the T-shirt. Mm -hmm. Can you tell us about it? What does it really mean to you? This means love. All right. I exist in England and I'm happy. Back in my country, we don't exist. I'm happy to be here. Thank you very much for watching. The consensus this afternoon, I've got Peter from Kenya, Hamza from Uganda, Nadine from Bangladesh, Julius from Cameroon, Dio from Uganda, I'm from Nigeria. The consensus here is that love is not a crime. And um, for various gov uh, government from all these countries, what we have to say is that do not use the LGBT community as bait to gather votes in your countries, to win votes. Concentrate on the issues at hand. And for parents, just be observant. Any child has right to live his or her life the way he's been created. We exist. Every child matters. Every child exists. Thank you very much for watching. This is still Atom Proud.
L African LGBTI YouTube channel. Keep watching, keep commenting, keep sharing, subscribe, turn on the notifi notification button to get more interesting videos from us. Thank you very much. Have a blessed day. Ready? One, two, three, four. We exist! Yay!